week, but it has been a pretty warm winter. NASA calling last month the second warmest February on record. That might be good news for a problem we all hate as drivers, those potholes in the road. 7 News reporter Brianna Smith, we see her live uh, with pothole predictions, the forecast for those in our area. Brianna. Yeah, we all know that cold weather causes those potholes, and it's been really, really cold this week. But has it been cold enough to cause those problems? We talk to experts, and they say only time's going to tell. Sophia Sullivan is up and down Spartanburg County roads every day, driving in her new to her car. Still making payments, and then I'm still hitting potholes. Potholes are her biggest problem, like most drivers on South Carolina roads. I hit probably like four or five of them a day going back and forth. And the public works departments are working hard to make sure that you're not hitting them. The city of Greenville says they're on track to fill just as many potholes as last year. DOT has already been busy repaving sections of I-85, hoping to get ahead of the pothole season. Spartanburg County says they've been busy too, but they're hoping since there wasn't as much rain mixed with cold this year, the potholes will be less. So Via is hoping for the same thing. So usually I go around, but Sometimes you just got to hit them. She says she has issues with her wheels that now need fix because of hitting those rotting roads. But when it tap your car, there's no way we can get anybody to pay for it. Now, there is a way for you to get some compensation. If a pothole's already been reported to DOT, you hit it and then you have damage, you can get some money for it. They are asking you to report any pothole you see to your public works department or your state department so that they can get those fixed right away. Live in Spartanburg tonight, Brianna Smith, 7 News. All right, Brianna, we appreciate the, uh, the forecast. Hopefully it doesn't get as bad as it could be this year. Brianna Smith reporting live for us tonight.